Central Okanagan search and rescue continue to look for a man who went into the water near McKinley Landing on Friday and did not resurface. COSAR have spent the last three days searching the water in nearby shore, but have yet to find the man. We squared off some grid areas last night and we're searching those at the moment and everything seems to go in the way it should be. COSAR members are using underwater camera and sonar to search the lake floor. The way that we're using it, it, the waves in the wind are not moving it around as much as it has been in the past. The individual could be the 10th person to drown this summer in the Thompson Okanagan. The amount of drownings this summer have been quite high. It's unusually high, I would say. Uh, so it's very concerning to us because we're the ones coming out and assisting the RCMP in recovering these individuals. The missing man is a tourist who was visiting the area. COSAR currently have 12 members assisting in the search. You'll notice that our search boat has a flashing blue light. That is an emergency light. So we're asking people when they see that to please stay away from our boat or the RCMP or the fire boats because they all have one of those. COSAR is reminding the public to swim and boat responsibly and always wear a life jacket. For Castanet News, I'm Addison Earhart in McKinley Landing.